So this is my TJ07. I've decided to do some upgrades to the case. Um, I've got a local powder coater who will be doing the interior in black for me. So while I've pulled it apart, I'm going to do a few upgrades. I always look forward to upgrades. Um, this time we'll be doing, uh, we've got some more water cooling hardware. We've got a four fan radiator. I'll also be changing the motherboard, a uh, new chip as well, and uh, a Vertex 2 SSD. So I'm just going to install the uh, Hammond box mod. Uh, this is the Hammond box and I'm going to use it to just cover up the um, PCB on the front of the TJ07. Uh, it's a pretty common mod I've seen in the forums. So I thought I'd do that, it looks pretty nice. Um, so here's get some screws with that. Here's the piece I'll be using. Um, I'm just going to cut a hole in the side, put two holes in the front to mount that to the case. Okay, so everything's been taken out of the case to be painted. Uh, this is the outside frame. You can see I've uh, sleeved the front panel connections using the uh, murder mod sleeving. So just uh, also cut out small cut in the uh, base here just so the uh, cables can pass through around the back of the uh, motherboard tray and here is the uh, plate that I'll be using this will just go over the top like this so I can um, I'll just put the uh, bits power pass throughs through there have the uh, railing just going in that along there and the cables will just pass through the back. Okay, powder coating's all finished. Came out really nice, except for my fingerprints. Okay, so that's all assembled now. Um, I've riveted the uh, railing on there. You can see I've bolted those on. I've also bol bolted on the uh, M3 socket head screws. Just finished reassembling the motherboard tray using the back plate from Chilled PC in the UK. When you're doing the um, reverse ATX mod, I just find that um, the back plate from Chilled PC just helped things line up a little better with the uh, railing. But it came out pretty good. Okay, the case is all assembled now. So, how it was, it just looked a little bit unfinished. So, now I'm really happy with that. Uh, here you can see the back plate. Now I've got a bit of room up the top there so I can put the uh, fans back in. Okay, the uh, radiator's installed. That's using the um, stand from Chilled PC in the UK as well. Just raises it up. Um, so it fits with the uh, TJ07. Okay, I'm just uh, testing the loop here. Everything's running really smoothly, really quietly. And um, you can see here how fast that's really um, pumping through there. Okay, here it is. So you can see it pumps through the red and then comes out and then up again yep so these are the new components that I'll be using uh, I've got the ASUS um, P55 motherboard uh, I've also got my 5870 with the EK water block you can see here this card I was using in my old system 
So it's just going into the uh, new board. Uh, this is the removable motherboard tray for, with the TJ07, which is a really good feature. You can assemble the board um, outside of the case and then just slide that in. Uh, I'll be using the Intel um, 750 CPU that'll be probably running at a uh, 3.6 and I've got the high flow EK water block last thing that I'll be working on for the PC is the power supply so I'm just going to sleeve these cables um, but I'll be using the small murder mod sleeving for each cable there you can see that the the colors are coming through um, yeah and here it is all, all done Okay, so this is it. Everything's in the case and working nicely. Everything's been powder coated in black. I've used the uh, black socket head screws. Our murder mod sleeving. Here's the uh, 90 gigabyte SSD.